So now let's go over to our player and set up a new brush. Also a trigger texture. Make it around him. Make sure that it's actually on top of him, which it is not. There we go. Is he completely surrounded by it? Yes, he is. So now let's uh, make another entity real quick before we do anything else and it will be called env underscore uh, instructor underscore hint <laughs> now I know that it says instructor but that's because in source and like uh, games such as uh, anybody who plays Gary's Mod, that's a great example, when you first start up uh, the official maps, there will be little HUD icons that appear at the bottom and tell you how uh, to play and what buttons to press to do what. Uh, well, that's pretty much what this does, except we can also use it to give the player messages of what's going on. So let's go ahead and click somewhere and create that. Let's double click on it to edit it. Let's name it welcome underscore message so for the positioning we're going to put on show on the HUD uh, which is heads up display HUD allow target invisible yes and set up the caption let's say welcome to my map exclamation point you can name it whatever you want this is just what's going to appear to the player and let's not mess with any of the other options for now hit apply then on trigger we're going to hold down control and T and we're going to name it uh, the class trigger once, once again, of course. Um, and let's name it. Well, let's not name it anything. Let's just leave it how it is. And for the output, let's add a new output. And on trigger, we're going to put in for a welcome message. And it's going to be show hint. And apply. So we did it correctly. Once again, always double check to make sure the input's here. So you send it to the right device. And it is here. And so, uh, real quick, let's go ahead and set one up for this. Show you how you can do uh, multiple triggers. Let's create one more entity. Double click on it, show on HUD, the aliens are coming, and then put down for no shaking, let's change it over to narrow shake, that's going to make the text shake on the screen. So then hit apply, come over here to trigger once and add another output, <laughs> whoops, not mark, I don't want to mark, I want to add. So on trigger, you're going to do welcome message and show hint, hit apply, double check over here and make sure the input's in, which it is not. So we messed up something. I know what we messed up. Okay, so we have to actually name this. This is warning message. Hit apply. And let's come over here to the outputs field and change this to warning message. Hit apply, double check. And see, that is why we always double check because it's very easy to make mistakes like that. And so that's it for uh, this tutorial gonna go ahead and test the map and show you guys the finished product should look like 
So here is our uh, weapon. Set it down. Build it. Works just fine. Go wait for the build. There we go. Let's pick up our other one. You can still switch between them. Aliens are coming. Little message there. And bam. That's how you make it work.